and welcome back to DMAZ Plays Psychonauts. In the last episode, we finished off Fred's brain and made him not so much of a pansy anymore, and we got the second to last item that we needed to get for to completing the Lobato costume. Now we must get the last and essential piece for completing the Lobato costume. And actually go talk to Edgar over there, who looks like he's doing something very interesting. And with me today is MJ Tamixter, who Hello. is go is still blind to what I'm doing, but it doesn't matter because she'll forget like a goldfish. <laughs> because I am a goldfish, as we just established like 20 minutes ago. Hey Edgar, what's up? What you painting there? That is my patron, my psychiatrist, my warden. <gasps> no, it's not. Looks like Doctor Lovato to me. <laughs> Is he the one who chained you up? The doctor won't Oh yeah, why are you chained up, dude? My treatment. So why don't you just finish the painting and go home? Why don't I just... Oh, the talk of artistry. It's just like, why don't you just finish the painting? I can't! You don't understand! I just can't! Oh, but we do understand. No, that's wow. his internal monologue. See? Sometimes you just have to... Oh Again, no, we do understand. He did a bullfight yeah. over the doctor's face. Well, yeah, because bullfights bull are awesome. Huh? huh? Edgar, why do you? Every time. Every time, dude. Every time it is the same. The matador, the bull. How I despise you both. Then just stop watching bullfights, man. <laughs> that is why I am here. Chained in more ways than you can see. You're a talking like a brooding. Art, a prisoner of art. <laughs> well, uh, I'm gonna go downstairs. You good? I'm good. <laughs> yeah, he's good because you know everybody. Under artists understand. It's just like, dude, I'm brooding. Leave me alone. How do I get up there? Mm -hmm. Okay, you know what? I spent like 20 fucking minutes looking for this god- well not 8 minutes looking for the side challenger. <laughs> and I found it completely by accident. I know you found it completely by accident. I actually, ironically enough, I really badly want to get, um, the- to get enough level ups to get to 85 to actually get enough to actually have the confusion upgrade before I actually need confusion. So we're gonna try that. Hi, Edgar. Hey, how's that painting of Dr. Lobato coming along? You know, I'll deliver it for you as soon as it's finished. Silence. I am conceptualizing. Oh, stop conceptual. I do I dare do this? Yes. Try my patience, Rasputin. Yes, I try your face. I punched him and knocked his cards down. Oh, I want to be able to do that. Dude, what did you do? He like lifted up the mound and like the cards reformed. I I want to be able to do that. Hey, you know what? Fuck you. We're just throwing a door on your face. Hmm. What is this? Are you working on an abstract piece? That's epically awesome. Yes, I'm working on an abstract nice piece. Color. I'm working on an abstract piece called your freaking face. Let's go. This, I think this is the best transition out of all of them when you're going into someone's brain. Because it really does capture um, the art style that they're talking about. Impressive house of cards you're building. Because everything the, is black not high enough to reach the with sky. color painted on it. Free like the velvet, the black velvet paintings. I only uh -huh. know that she is beautiful. Perfect. Sad. All day she cries rose petal tears, and I can do nothing to help her because my creation lacks something, and it will not stand against the bull. What bull? El Odio. El Odio. Goodness gracious! It is the Odio, and he will rampage. Goodness gracious, we're gonna Somewhere die. Along the way, I feel that I lost yeah, something absolutely. important. 
in all kinds of hilarious ways, hopefully. Yeah. It's your queens. You want me to go look for them? Bring me any card you find. I must complete this tower. Yes. Uh oh, God. I forgot that happened. Oh. I, I always wonder how he realizes that the deck is missing queens from just from what he's seeing. Wait, there's no queens in the deck? Well, you have to go find his queens. Oi, that sounds annoying. Oh, no. Nah. This is actually a pretty linear world. The only problem is... Um... The way you have to take to get everywhere. The gimmick of this world is, you're running down the streets against... There's a giant bull. Oh my god, are you alright? Poor little guy. Oh, thanks for caring about me. Thanks for caring about me. You pick up your painting and don't give a shit about me. Anyway, the gimmick with this world is that you're running against the bull that is rampaging down the streets. And you have to get up the streets to get all the queens to help Edgar create a path to the lady. And you cannot stop the bull, so that you have to platform around the bull. If you get hit by the bull, he takes you to the nearest um, checkpoint. The nearest open area that you haven't passed already. Which is annoying as hell. Thank you. Alright you, what are you doing? Hey, have you seen a really big playing cards, man? Cards here. Hey Mickey, have you seen that big playing cards? Not, not since the last time I watched Alice in Wonderland. Man, well, dogs. damn it. Well, we've seen a really big chess set, but. Uh -huh. So the cards, you know where they are? Oh right. Well, I do know about these four lost queens, but that's all. You can't do much with four queens, can you? Yeah, you can. Those are exactly the cards I need. I'm Where just making him talk. Talkity talk, talk, talk. So much. Hey, I'm talking to a dog in a sombrero, man, You're with the mustache. Here, your head just to teach you now I want to watch the three caballeros. I blame you. Okay. Well, you know what? I know how to get out of the alley. Well, see ya. Keep up the street now. Oh, fuck you. Yep. Enjoy your new art there. Okay, so the other gimmick about this is, which is why the other reason why I say I get a lot of arrowheads. Um, you can buy you buy paintings to create new pathways and um, other objects within the world. Mm -hmm. And there is a reason why Enjoy I bought that rose, there. but I'll explain that in a minute. But we buy this; it has zero cost because it's the actual way out of here. Nice. Now I can get Edgar's cards. Yes. Now we can go exploring. Well. See ya. Keep off the street now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, the bull runs by every so often. It's freaking annoying. I need a speed of trunk tag for this guy. Yep. Oh, goodness. Why am I lagging so much? Game. We're not even at the hard part yet with the Lodio. The pink bull. Yes, the bull is pink. The bull is pink. The bull is bright, freaking like hot pink. Well, it was in his painting. Yeah. So I guess I shouldn't be too surprised. And we haven't got and we haven't gotten a dingo, so. Who is the matador? The dingo. No, dingo is his name. And dingo was his name. Oh. All right. No. Oh God. No bite. No. No God. Go away. Go away. Go away! No! Go away! I don't like you. I don't think he wants to. No, it was the steroid sensor that I triggered on accident. I don't like them. I don't like them either. There's just one weird gimmick about this one in particular. Um, in this area, they actually kind of have weird spawning points and they will respawn because leaving an area constitutes as some of the streets. Okay, anyway. So what you do with these roses, you see that Find Chica's house over there. Hello, lady. If you have a rose, they will actually let you come in and stay in the house. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Seriously? Yes. Yes, I'm not even shitting you. But, it's essential just because, um... 
it works in the sense of it helps you avoid the bull in some places. And uh -huh. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna run against you, bitch. No. Aha! You didn't get me that time. Now see how she actually looks around and sees you? Actually, wait. I don't wanna check something real quick. Okay. Oh, she sees you as a pervert. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, like you're gonna flash her. <laughs> That's pretty epic. <laughs> okay, that just that that was that was worth it. That was worth it. No, oh, that okay. That was just worth it. Even though I kind of back I backtracked to get the bag, but that was worth it for that. Just to see that. Okay, I think I can probably do this. Yes, I can. Am I gonna make this? Is the question. Haha! -ha! In your face! In your face, Elodio! Oh, hi, sensors. Guess what? And that's why I like. Yeah, like a boss. And that's why I like Chainsaw Blast. Okay, I think this is- is this one? Yes, it is. Okay. So in this one, they actually have a lot of telekin- a lot of telekinesis puzzles. Where you have to throw crap against other crap to unlock areas. Hi, guys. I mean, which is just nice so you can get pathways around the bowl. And like, th I think this and Boy's World are like the two that change the most upon coming back. Just because you could do so- it's like, you have the obstacle and then like, you don't need to deal with it anymore. Okay. So if you- Oh, hi. Tag. Come here. I want that. I hear a bag crying, but is it- Oh wait, is it the bag I'm- Okay, never mind, that's a bag I can get later. Well, I can actually have to get later. Um, because if I could get it now, that would like cheat around half the world. Okay! Oh look, it's a queen! Ah, oh, shit. Okay, the gimmick of this- other gimmick of this world. There's a lot to- there's a lot to tell the story. It's kind of one of the nicely layered worlds. I need to pyrokinesis. I cheat a little bit. Okay, so we jump through this portal. 